So at the four by four, we got four uh, QB96s. So over here we had issues with thrips. So I went ahead and rigged these up. These were closer. So I had the cover crop going. I cut all that down. Um, put some build a flower and some holly barley and then i also planted a whole bunch of seeds we got the marigold uh, a mix of flowers radishes beets daikon radishes basil lavender lemon mint and then dill and then i also threw in the chef anna This is, and my hands ashy when I'm working. Uh, Chef Anna, the casserole. So it was a mixed feminized pack, five pack, um, pop two in. So I planted it right there and right there. So when I opened the tent, when I originally opened the tent, I thought I saw a thrip on one of the plants, one of the cover crop plants. Um, but when you take a closer look, you're not seeing any specks or anything. So it's not that bad. And then as I cut it, now they're low enough for the, the rove beetles to get to them, to get to the, the larva, the eggs, everything, as, as well as the hypoascus mouse. So those are all in there. So hopefully uh, those plants will do okay. I also, I also went ahead and sprayed some Mammoth P can control. Um, so I chopped the plants and then I sprayed and then I watered in a whole bunch of stuff. Some Trinity Recharge, uh, Mammoth P, the microbes, and then uh, herb. So I put all that in, re-sprayed the top with Mammoth P um, just in case. You know, just in case uh, the, the thrips are still feeding on the, the canyon matter. So. Hopefully they'll eat that and they'll go somewhere else. Uh, so I cut all this cover crop down, plant a new cover crop. So we're just keeping this cycle going. I got probably like two or three cycles. I don't know, I think I cut all that stuff out because of the thrips. Yeah, stuff like that. I think I'm gonna cut that one out. Yeah, other than that, or maybe not, just, just chop it and drop it. Yeah, so. And it auto, so we should have some in two, two and a half months, maybe three. I figured um, instead of trying to clone and bringing clones over here, I'll work with autos over here. So I'll get some Mephesto seeds. Um, I'm gonna get those tomorrow. And then I might end up getting some more Chef Anna's, depending on how these do, or some Rock Bud, uh, some seeds from Rock Bud. So yeah, I just wanna see how these do. Um, yeah, I'm definitely only doing two and I'm doing side by side instead of front and back because I can't get back to work. When the plants come up, I'll pull the net forward and have them start, you know, weaving the plant through, but and tucking and tucking and weaving. So uh, that's it for this one.